the heart of the atomic emission detector is the excitation source, in this example, a microwave discharge. Chemical analytes that exit the capillary column flow into the discharge chamber along with the carrier gas and sometimes even additional reagent gases plumbed in via auxiliary gas lines. In this chamber, microwave coils power a very high energy plasma that destroys the analyte molecules and in doing so creates excited states of the analyte's constituent atomic elements. When these excited state atoms lose their energy, they emit light that is characteristic of the excited element. The light from each of these destructive events is directed via a mirror onto a diffraction grating which separates, in space, the individual colors, that is, wavelengths, that make up that analyte's microwave discharge beam. The separated colors fall on a diode array detector which determines the wavelength and intensity of each. Since different analytes contain different elements, the final pattern of wavelengths is a fingerprint of the atoms in that analyte. In this way, the presence and amount of specific atoms in an analyte can be detected. The result is a chromatogram displaying peaks with elemental information in addition to retention time and intensity.